On a personal level, how are you doing, Athene? Actually, that's a really good question. I want to say one more thing. This is to the people here. I want to actually say something personal. I want to say something personal to the people here. Um, this is actually quite personal, by the way. It is quite personal. And it's, it might sound very strange, but man, oh man, I, I do want to say it because it kept me a bit busy the past few days, like five days ago, I think, or six days ago, like, um, I, uh, like Ricardo showed me, you know, the, the age distribution from the people here, like everyone's age, right? Because I just wanted to know, like, what's the average age of people here and such. And, um, I saw a lot of people are already 30, you know, even more or 28, 29, 30. And, um, And, and I remember them coming over when they were 24 or 22. And um, like, it just makes me realize that that people really, that people really First of all, that people really trust me a lot to really commit such a big part of their life in a project like this, which I do not take for granted. Like it's, it's, it, it really is like, um, it is definitely, it just makes me reflect on It just makes me reflect on how important it is that I don't fuck up because I'm not just, it's not just about me not succeeding. It's about a part of your life that I know you guys choose for it, but of course you guys trust me. So like I cannot fuck up. And, and I know that very often when it comes down to, you know, the shit that has also happened in here, it's not in my control, but that's not good enough. Like if, if, if for whatever reason tomorrow something bad happens, like the, the game gets banned or whatever, like it's like, I really, sh I really experience a very, very strong sense of responsibility and accountability to make sure that things succeed. And, uh, when I see then like, you know, I already have that by default, but when I see that like it really makes me put in perspective, like in total, there's at least one life that has been spent on working on this game and people wanting to have an impact in the world and putting all this effort. And I just, you know, I do want to say that I, I don't take it for granted. And it's, it's actually quite surreal to come to that realization, even though I know people make these choices themselves. It's still, for me, seeing that, I really, uh, yeah, like I, I really, it's just very, uh, It's just very, I don't know what word to use, but like it's, um, it's personally very touching for me that people res like trust me that much because it's crazy. It's really crazy. But on the other hand, I also feel a crazy level of responsibility. I just cannot fuck up. Just want to tell you that, uh, it's like, because I know a lot of people are also into purpose and doobie and stuff, like also viewers and stuff, but that's still different than people here spending six years of their life working on a project 
fully dedicated and committed um, because they want to do good in the world and they follow they well they trust me they trust me like that's I I really yeah it's it's I will not lose perspective of that at all and seeing these kind of numbers I know it's kind of strange thing to say but it's so crazy it's really uh, makes me silent and reflect on these things and um, yeah like I can of course not promise that we are gonna you know that the game is gonna be all over the place I cannot promise it but I can tell you that we will be the best game out there and uh, and we will use it as a force for good and, and, and help poor people and do good. But man, it's really hard. It's not easy. It's not easy. It's, it's, it's a struggle. It's much more a struggle than I thought, even though, like I showed you guys at the start, our numbers are insane. But the world is, is rigged. The world is fucking rigged. And I know that's not good enough for me to just say that we need to do even well I need to do better myself to make sure that even if, if even if the world is rigged against us we still win because it's what I owe you guys for trusting me and it's what I owe the world too I just want to say that I don't take it for granted and I really respect and appreciate that on a personal level that people trust me so much so yeah Thanks for that, and uh, I will do all my best not to, uh, at least not to let down your trust, and uh, and really try everything possible to to achieve what we what what why we're here, like what we're why we're doing what we're doing. But it's really it's just hard. It's a struggle because the the game is rigged pretty much like against us it's just so unfair but it is what it is so yeah i just wanted to tell you guys that um yeah it's it's uh six years is well it's what people go in school like people that go to school it's like they go to school for like even more than that but still even if people leave or whatever, you still, some people can code or some people, you know, like there's a lot of people learn stuff here anyway, but still, I, I, I'm really, uh, yeah, like I don't take it for granted. That's all. I will make sure that we're going to change this fucking world because, because we, yeah, we need it. Like I, I will make sure to do our best so yeah that's 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 all i gotta say thanks for that and uh yeah that's that's pretty much uh it uh, not so uh you know all this uh i just wanted to say that on a on a personal note uh thanks for the trust you guys put in me and uh yeah i really i i, I push myself as much as i can to to achieve why you guys trust me, which is having a positive impact in the world. That's all. Oh yeah, either way. Um, if you guys have other questions, people that watch the VODs later, whatever, like you can write them down and ask them next week. I'm also doing these weekly updates. Uh, today was a lot more updates than usual. Um, but yeah. <laughs> 